Hello, my name is Angela Mamboy and I'm the reigning Miss Kenya USA. And basically that means that I act as a representative for Kenya in the US. And as a beauty queen, my main duty is to act as a goodwill ambassador both to Kenya and the US. So a lot of the work that I do um, is focused around enriching the lives of young people everywhere. Um, I work a lot with a lot of Kenyan Americans um, and also work with a lot of Kenyan youth here in Kenya. Um, on my visit to Kenya, I've been busy visiting different high schools, um, different girls schools, just trying to teach them what it means to be a global citizen and how you can use things like technology to really empower yourself, empower your community and broaden your voice to the whole world. So. Um, and yeah, today and last week I've been had the pleasure and the honor of being here in Kibera to really see what is Kibera all about? What is Kibera outside of media? You know, who are the young people of Kibera? And it's been quite an eye-opening experience. But Kibera is not just a slum. It's more than just a slum. Uh, you know, statistically it is the largest slum in all of Central and East Africa. But it is a community of hardworking people. Uh, one thing that really surprised me as we walked down through the slums was the fact that there were so many small businesses. Everything from food to shoes to clothing to hair. Like these are people that are actually working, still trying to make a living, but it is so hard to make a living amongst people that don't even have sufficient housing or funding or sanitation. Um, so I think that's one thing that surprised me the most, the fact that there's so many people out there still trying to hustle, still trying to make it. Um, you still see a lot of happiness in Kibera. You know, the kids, um, I think when you have so little, it forces you to use your creativity. So whether it means creating your own toys out of plastic bags, um, the women of Kibera, they make the purses out of Nakuma bags. Um, you have the young men that are making jewelry out of bones. So it teaches you how to be very resourceful and creative. Um, so it's been um, a warm experience. You know, people are very welcoming. You know, they greet me. Hi, Miss Kenya. We got to say hi to some of the kids. So it was really nice.